I'm I'm sure it's easy. I've just it, never done it before. It is easy. Find user and then you click it and it says like all the things that you've done before. It's so crazy. <laughs> oh, front row seats to the season opener, dude. Does it get better? Oh I... yeah, maybe. I'm not sure it does get better. But I do need a second for it here though. So yeah, name? we'll 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 make sure you're you're ready. It is Toad's a boss. E O A D S A. Are you the Gen Five girl? I don't know. I don't think I have a specific avatar. Okay. Oh, it's just to confirm. I need to change my avatar to uh someone. Yeah, you got a good cool. Uh, it looks like I am currently the Gen Five girl. Yeah, uh, good choice, Ryan. All right, you ready? Team against Ryan. Avatar change. Is Zach ready? Yeah, I'm ready. I'm good to go. You are ready? Okay, sounds good. I don't like being deafened, but um, Ian, just make sure you don't like tell us anything that's I not am, common knowledge. I, I am uh, going to be essentially silent. Okay. So All right. I'm gonna die. Right. <laughs> yeah. Good luck to you oh. guys. Here we go. Season opener. No sun. All right, Jack just said no sun. So I did mock a good bit. Hang on, let me move my Discord onto my other monitor. Oh my god, it's, it's chaos right now. Okay, here we go. We're already right, right going. It's, it's fucking full. Stuff's happening here. Okay, this is this is the exact thing that I said to Ryan that 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 Jack would do at the beginning. Um, is you turn with that tailwind? Okay, will Ryan click? I want to make sure I'm deafened. Okay, yeah. Will Ryan click explosion here? This is the question. Jack was like mocking it pre uh, pre go here, but it'd be pretty crazy. Here we go. Season opener. I mocked with Ryan beforehand. Um, brought a team relatively similar. <laughs> there you go. So now they're probably talking fun. Good good switch by him. Rebel room here gets to click. Uh, High horsepower. So Napoleon's bad switch into that. It probably gets too KO'd. Balloon! So good! Shift gear. Ooh, the big shift gear, though. Kind of spooky. This thing's going to hit like a truck right now. I don't know if it touches Napoleon with too much. Like a steel-type move. Zen headbutt. Resisted. No flinch. Okay, no flinch. Get a nice crit. You could put that, that could get put in um, range of something. Do you have, like... He's got like weather ball that I just see on SPN. That's cool. Um, but yeah, Ryan didn't bring sun. This Reverend looks like it doesn't really have any checks right now, dude. Like I don't know how it. But does Don Fan live one? Does does Don Fan live a a plus one hit? And and get to click earthquake or something? Cause otherwise, this Reverend might just sweep. He's got tailwind for one turn. Yeah, it's great. Does not touch this thing. We're scarf Don Fan, but you. You gotta be slower, I would think. Ryan's plus two. I don't know. I don't know Don Fan's base or uh, base speed. Kilowatt. That's fine. If you get him to switch to kilowatt really here, you're very very happy. So the team that I brought for Jack's side, because I was blocking with Ryan, was minus Don Fan, minus Napoleon, plus Annihilate, plus. Crocolor. <laughs> Daddy Don Fan, that's funny. Um, it's good damage. Fuck, this is pretty. Yeah, this is offensive Don Fan, obviously, because it's scarfed. But, um, and I, I like the Crocolor a lot into Ryan's team. Ryan actually switched up his team because of it. He originally had Frost Moth and instead brought uh, Walking Wake because he was spooked of the the Crocolor potential. But. Definitely didn't was not ready for offensive Don fan out of this guy at all. That's pretty fucking scary. Napoleon switching into that. He doesn't have a balloon anymore. I feel like you're just gonna lose to this thing. It's a good knock. You have I mean earth headlong rush will kill you. Very, very easily. You have no switch into that. To headlong rush, maybe. No, Meow Scry, I might get outsped. I don't know what his set is on it. But, like, I don't know if you get, um, if you can take two. It might live one, but I don't think you take two. 
Jack had a, a pretty solid start here with the Balloon and Napoleon, but now that's gone. I, I, I don't know. I, I don't know how offensive he is here. He's got flip turn, serve, for East Aqua Jet. If you can do a calc or something, see how much the Aqua Jet does. <laughs> Nothing? Oh my god. You're probably just dead. Yeah, I, th I think you're just dead to this. Uh... Right. Well, no, you're not dead. You need to go, like, Miascrot or Espeon. There you go. What does this thing end up taking here? Okay, all four attacks is what it looked like. Only Pokemon that he can Terra that he brought is um, Espeon, to my knowledge, and it was Terra Fairy, which is also what I brought. I My side on Espeon that I had was... Calm Mind, Dazzling Gleam, Morning Sun, Roar. Um, I like the Morning Sun. It's a full, full heal in, in Sun. Giant did not bring, but it'd be kind of sick with the Calm Mind set up. And then Roar on, like, Rever Room, basically. Like, when it wants to click a shift gear, you just roar it out and hangs out. There you go. Good KO. He's got to be Scarfed, right? Ryan is plus speed there. Scarfed out beyond. I didn't quite see, but... Very likely. Unless you just max speed. Uh, it's, it's, it's things like 110. I think uh, Great Tusk is maybe like 87 speed. But. Oh. I will just. Um, will not look it up. Fuck it. I gotta refix my OBS. I like changed it up the other day. Removing my. Uh, what do you call it? The like team leader and shit, and then changing to hot mons instead of repulse stray grace. All right, so Jack had a pretty good spot here. He's got to figure out that. No, yeah, no, 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 no way that you're faster with Espeon just being invested than uh, 1.5 speed great test. He's got to figure out that he's that he's scarfed here, right? So then. Grim Shady is a pretty good bring-in on this. I think you're just going to get fucking clowned. When this thing sort of stands on his on you. You, you, have to you have to get Miascarada in and, uh, and go for a knock is the answer to this Pokemon. I wonder what Ryan's um, item is. He was like on the fence in between Sash and Boots. Obviously, it seems as if Boots would have been a pretty bad take. Jack's super duper not in the Stealth Rock agenda here. He's got, like, Offensive Empoleon, Offensive Don Fan. The Empoleon's more of a pivot, but it's got, like, it doesn't, ha it doesn't have rocks either. The Psychic, Bitter Blade, you're going to heal up most of the way. I just You just click Psychic again right now? Okay. He's going to save Espeon. Yeah, you're, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know if you're gonna touch this thing, dude. Better waves, nice. We have lefties. Yeah, so we have lefties. We can go for a protect. Next turn. Yeah, yeah. You, you don't, you don't want to just sit in this thing's face or uh, protect it right now because you can click SD. You could take protect like once, then he starts get, clicking SD on your uh, on your protect turns, so you can kind of 50-50 it, but it's tough. Hard gamble. Pretty bad risk reward. Ryan get to be plus two. T wave. There you go. I don't know if you're, if you're faster. You're in a decent spot here. Kind of. Has to go for a full para maybe. Moon moonlight up. You you live a shadow sneak. I feel like. Moon blast ain't gonna do anything. You can't Terra. Oh my God! Please God, don't Terra. I feel like somebody's going to do that eventually, and it's going to be chaos. But you might have to go for a, uh, a little para-hax angle here. Yeah, Moonlight doesn't do anything, because you, you took, uh, what, like, 68 from it or so? This obviously doesn't do anything either. I liked Baton Pass quite a bit on my Clefable. Alright, so we got the Mariosker out in. It's got knock. What was the fucking far right move it had? 
I saw a knock, I saw a U-turn, I saw a flower trick. Did not see the far right move. At all. I think missing out on Sucker is a pretty big deal. And Reverum comes in on this thing big. Like, no move that Meowstrat has hits Reverum. You get, it gets to set up in this thing's face. Ryan's not streaming. He's saying he's gonna stream. Maybe as soon. Maybe I can pick, click point of view here. See what he's thinking about. But kind of 50/50 here on staying on the grass type move versus switch out on the dark type move. But I think Reverend's a really good um, middle ground play. Goes for Shadow Sneak. Okay. And he, okay, and he's also flash fire on uh on what's his face here. Didn't end up going weak armor. Big crit from Shadow Sneak, that's good. Like I feel like Rubber Room just gets to come in and click shift gear and sweep, no? It really feels like what's going on. It's not nothing is gonna happen from this knockoff. You get to click shift gear. I I don't remember how healthy Gudra was. That's the only thing. But Ryan was packing um high horsepower on it, so you I would I'd assume you'd kill excuse me kill kill guy when you're plus one. Okay, you're slower than this unless you're unless you're scarfed. I didn't I I haven't seen what his item is if he's scarfed or banned. Ryan was bringing Terra Ground on this. Um, Terra Ground Terra Blast was uh. Is what he was up to. It's a pretty important crit. It's a pretty important crit. Um, he's scarfed. Yeah, no, you're, you're still slower. Ooh. I wonder if he could have prepped for being faster than that, but but he's, he has to be really invested into that. If you're bringing scarfed on fans, certainly you must be faster than Kilowatchel or something. Meowskara, flower, flower tricks here is a big threat. Grass Knight is his other move. Did he switch it up? He's got to be... Okay, so he's Scarfed Kilowattril, actually. Okay. Actually, what am I even thinking? That That's what Ryan was then, as well. Ryan is Scarfed Kilowattril. I'm just stupid. Okay, that's a scary bring-in, because doesn't Flower Trick here go nuts? And I feel like... Is, is Reverum chunked? Do I not remember? No, Reverum's at 75%. What is Ryan doing? He's bringing a Walking Wank that takes no damage. Of course, that's what... I mean, what am I thinking? Mainly... Walking Wake, okay, so we get to Terra here. Uh, so 50-50 on, am I switching or not? Because you will lose. I, I think you're just dead regardless, right? Because I think Reverum beats the Gudra in 1v1. I'm pretty sure Ryan wins here, even if like Walking Wake goes down. Because then SPN doesn't touch Reverum. Stays in, gets the KO. All right, Ryan. What you got here? Full HP Reverum takes negligible damage from Dazzling Gleam. And your other moves aren't going to KO either. You should calc, make sure. I would calc, make sure Shadow Ball. Um, if Shadow Ball KOs, maybe maybe you can go for a switch here. But Ryan's going to click the safe move. Poison Jab. I would think. Kind of close. Exciting first game, though. A lot, lot people are clicking buttons a lot slower, I would say, on average. Maybe not. I mean, I click buttons really, really slow, because I would, like, help literally everything. But, um... Cool Assault Fest set. Four attacks. Draco. Ice Beam, Thunderbolt. Flamethrower. Pretty sick. Shift Gear. Okay, so, so, so he knew that he lived, so he gets to click the Shift Gear for free. High Horsepower doesn't miss. Ryan wins the game. Good dub. That should be a W P G G. That's resisted. Or no, it's, it's, it's neutral rather. But I think I think you're probably slower. Yep, you live. There you go. Good game. Oh my God, was that a close one?
Good game. Oh, that was a Holy wow. moly. I... The only thing I would have changed is I shouldn't have sacked my kilowatt. Oh, that was kind of stupid. And then after I did it, I said, oh shit. I think I lost. I think if you left Meowskarda back in, I... And instead of sacking it on my yeah. flamethrower, I would have... I think I would have lost. But when I killed that, I think it came winnable for me. I think it's really good that you didn't bring uh, an Isle Ape, Jack. I, when playing with Ryan, yeah. I thought that an Isle Ape seemed ass, and then I'm, I was impressed that that's some, that something on your radar to not bring, because it's such a obvious, it seems like it's such an obvious bring uh, normally. I fucked up a couple times. I was really First hoping that you weren't uh, skip gear. Uh, that Wait, what? Was, say that again? I was hoping you weren't shift gear. I, I uh, always bring shift gear. That's, that's, that's all that's the, that's the, that's I think. I feel like uh, even, I, even then, it's gonna I be like never <laughs> need you. shift Unless gear. Why? Why? Well, I, I triple start. You had triple Meow Scarda, Espeon, and the Don. Don fan was scarf. Yeah. So I could outspeed Reverum. I could also outspeed. Probably, tails. probably kill watch roll without no, kill watch roll without boosted. Did you outspeed that or no? No, it was like 328 or something. 327. Mm. So you couldn't quite outspeed that. It's tough. And then no, but, I um, no, I shared ring either on it. No, but I had ice spinner. Yeah, but yeah, with the, if you're slower though, it's tough. That was close. I was, that's that's what here, I get to say about that one. Made it quick. Yeah, I'd say if you're ever. Not expecting shift gear on a Pokemon that can bring shift gear, expect it instead. Cause... Also, I, I took too much damage on my Gudra. That move is dang good. I got a huge crit on Donphan, that is for sure. Yep. Um, and Gudra taking more damage than I thought to my explosion as well. Um, we're kind of the yeah, the, the, explo the explosion did there, happen, though? bro. That's what was funny. Uh, well, because I, I saw he didn't have a ghost type, so I was just like, well, I'm just going to click this. Yeah, I know, but Jack was, b before the before you were back in here, he was, like, la if, laughing if, about it. If, if Shift Tree Explosion kills me, I'm going to punch a hole in my wall. <laughs> How, what was your, uh, what was your Gudra set? I had Did... Assault Vest, Draco Meteor, Thunderbolt, okay. Flamethrower, and... Ice Beam. Yeah, that, that, that shit was scary. I knew that was... I, I didn't like my walking wake at all. I like I think when I I didn't have it in at first, but when I was playing against Zach, I had uh, I had my Frost Moth instead. But he brought uh your Crocolor, your Crocolor, and that was like impossible for me to break. Um, for a lot, I think I only got it that one game when I knocked off its EV light. Yeah, Crocolor because like was I, I was I was beast. looking at walking wake and it was like. The I expected seven of your Pokemon, and none of them were super effective to Water or Dragon, and I was just like, well, I just feel like this Pokemon's kind of not very good. But then the Crocler brought it back in. I was just like, ah, this is like a legendary Pokemon. I might as well bring it. It's got good stab. But that thing, nothing on my team can survive that. I don't. Like, I feel like I have no uh, no answer to that really. I think. What, what was it? Water oh, outspeeding it, which is what. Yeah, well, which which you did. Yeah, I didn't. I as you'll see when I post my set, I didn't put speed on anyone except uh, my Great Tusk and Kilowattro. I think were the only two that I put speed on, and everybody else I invested in health and tankiness. Oh, I think Sarah Ledge, I had sped or speed crep. Uh, your Annihilate. Because most of the time you don't bring any speed, so I had a plus one on that just in case, because I thought that was going to be kind of my main answer. But so you had you had defense on Feral Edge. Yeah. And then... No, I think I did HP on on most. Um, yeah, that's let me that's, let me go that's to my gen stats. generally yeah, what what yeah. you do if you're going to yeah. go bulk is go into HP. So and Ryan, you, you ended up being Flash Flare, didn't you on on Feral Edge, right? I did. I changed at the last second too, but I don't think I just took psychic moves, right? That's that's what Feral yeah. Edge did. Yeah, or, or not psychic, um, yeah, special like, attack moves. Yeah. You're really unf- Oh no, it was Meowskiarda knockoff, is what it was. 
so that could have actually been different if I did weak armor. But yeah, also... you were you were you were, you were paired though, so you just been neutral. It wasn't that big of a deal. Oh, yeah, that's that's true. That's true. But yeah, that was I I should have clicked my bitter blade. But I was just like ah, eh, like I was I was looking at the calc. You were on the way low. I think it was like ninety eight to like one hundred seventeen percent of my health. <laughs> Yo, Jack. Knockoff. I what was that? Scarf. You put more than six seven, six Pokemon in for a team? I've never seen that before. In that box. That's crazy. Whoa! I gotta start doing that shit, bro. That's that's a level up right there. What? <laughs> I didn't know about that. You can put more than six Pokemon on a team. So is what it looks no, you like. Have to make a box. Oh, you can make a box. Well, sure. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But just just to I like did, uh, just to like copy the sets though for other, for other shit. Ryan's it's, team it's, in a box as well. It's kind of nice. Yeah, I I I'd love you that. Almost put Ryan's team in a box. Yeah, Troy. Yeah, I'm gonna yeah, start doing my team in a box. Start doing that for for speed. But yeah, Jack, you have you have what to got um. What KOs that turn or that game? What was what now? What got KOs? Like what, what's uh? Um, my. I I, I have the recording. Kilowatt did minimum. work. I'm pretty sure. I can check it after My, after the yeah. Well, I I still have the thing. Oh, you, you still you still have the thing. Okay, sure. But um, but yeah, Jack, make sure you um submit your your team here. But uh yeah, GG's good first game, guys. Fucking bit exciting. Little, exciting. A little yeah. little different on the best of one vibe, but it's a good time.